guys. I am going to do a video today. It's been a minute since I've done like actual video where I talk about things. Been super busy. My uh, dad fell and broke his hip, so I've been um, visiting him a lot. Now he's in uh, rehabilitation for it now, so I feel a little more at ease. He's out of the hospital and he's not home. So let me tell you, I was worried he was going to go home, and I felt so stressed out. I had to try to get him to talk into going to the rehabilitation place. So. Yeah, it was uh, worrisome. Lost a lot of sleep over it. But he made the smart decision and went. He decided his daughter was smart and he should listen to her. Something like that anyways. <laughs> Just gonna spread my white on this canvas quick. I need some more. We'll see. Um, I was gonna talk about something that has definitely been happening to me and I was just curious how many other people might have this issue as well. Um, once the fall hits and that time change hits, it's like, a, it's like a seasonal depression that sinks in. It gets darker earlier, sun's not out as often, and when it's out, it's not out for long. It is an issue for me every year. Some years are worse. Um, trying to keep busy or I've been busy but it's still been bothering me a little bit but I, I uh, I'm, I'm getting I'm working on it so yeah I was just I was real curious to hear if anybody else if this is an issue or does it happen if you if it happens when does it happen like it, mine pretty much like clockwork when the time changes and we lose um, an hour during the day is when it definitely hits me. And also, I think it doesn't help that it gets cold and I suffer from chronic pain. So when it's cold, um, I am in more pain. So that's always a blast. But yeah, so I was just wondering if anybody else has that. And I've actually heard of quite a few people that have um, depression. Um, also have like an added, added depression during these months. And that's how mine is. I have chronic, you know, like a chronic depression, clinical, major depressive disorder, but it gets worse during these months. And I am definitely open for suggestions on how to get through it. I used to go tanning a lot years ago during these months. It would help a lot, but, you know, skin cancer. So I don't do it very often anymore. And I know that, you know, right now this is our natural, you know, regular time. It's when we have daylight savings that it's not our natural time, but... I really do love daylight savings. I'm going to do this coliander, coliander um, pour today. I've seen it a few times, people doing it. Some of them turn out really cool, some of them not so much, but I am going to try it. So. turns out. I know I 
have um, the colors I wanted to use are in bottles right already, so it'd probably be easier just to pour cups, but I just went with the bottles. What made me like this was I did one with like a sink strainer or a sink, you know, that you put in your sink. And um, I did it with one of those on a coaster. Yeah, coaster. There you go. I'm making coasters now. We'll see how that turns out. But yeah, so I did that and I really liked the colors and liked how it turned out. So I'm doing it with this. A bigger... Something's got a friend over, so they, you may hear them playing. In the background. Although I think they're good. I think my husband told them that I was recording. So we may not hear them. I don't know. Really curious to see how this turns out, though. I think it's going to take a lot of paint for this the board that I'm using though, so... Hopefully I don't go through these paints already, I just got them. Most of them. Yeah, I haven't really painted on a canvas in a minute. Been super busy and um, just haven't really. I, every I, I'll think about it. I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it, and then I'm like, no, I'm not gonna do it. Not today. Yep. Part of that depression. It'll do it to you every time. See it's starting to come out already at the bottom, so that's cool. Um, some more. Start a little wider. I'm gonna let it sit for a minute and see if it'll drain out a little bit more. I think I'm gonna end up having to lift it to get it to drain out good. I'll just give it a second. But yeah, so the time change, it just messes me up. It messes me up both ways, but like mentally this way, it messes with me. I absolutely hate it. So yes, I uh, started doing um, coasters, so on tiles I've been painting, pour painting, and uh, they're turning out pretty cool, so I'm excited about that. stretch it. This will look cool if I can set it down and uh, and make a skin out of it for another project. <laughs> Guess I'm just going to reveal everything I'm doing. Making magnets with the skins from my pores. Let that sit there. Oh look at that. Isn't that cool? Reminds me of a peacock. The colors. 
So I'm going to try stretching it a little bit. You know what? There's a lot of air bubbles in there. Give me a torch. I forgot to wear gloves again. So I'm trying to, I want to get a, some things done so I can take them and try to sell them. I don't know how well they'll sell, but I think it would be cool. I keep forgetting I have this rag hanging. That helps. Oops, see now it's falling off that edge a little bit. That's just being even. This is pretty much what it's going to look like. I might tweak it a little bit, but I'll have a picture at the end of the video. Um, so, I'll see you guys in a little bit. I'm going to do another one. I'll post it another day or something, but bye-bye. I'm just going to tweak this paper.